is up guys hearthstone shaman arena part two we are four and oh right now so take a look at our deck got a lot of the op shaman cards three zappomatics and of course fire guard and the faceless so let's get right into it hopefully we can get 12 wins i must protect the one for doom hammer hmm. okay let's go ahead and scrap these Probably hold on to the Scarlet. It's a good turn three play. All right, good. We got our Zapomatic. Let the OPness begin. Raven Idol. It seems like all Druids have this card. Must just be like an auto include in every Druid deck. Hmm. I think we'll pass. We don't have a turn two play. Zap on two. Then Scarlet on three. Another night on the prowl. Hmm. You could change the plans. We could go coin Scarlet, but then we don't have a turn three play. So, I guess Sap it is. Looks like I might just trade here, but that's okay. Makes paves the way for Scarlet. Mm, but it gets wrath. Got wrath. That's insane. All right, here we go. Then Yeti on four. Or we could do faceless. I'll do faceless. Deal with this. That means we overload, so we have a 3 drop, or coin out a 4 drop next turn. So we'll have basically f uh, 3 mana. Alright, that's cool. Big guy. Now, he wants to go ahead and... He could trade here for the 4 and the 7, so... We'll stop the trade. Even though it looks like the Yeti is going to get a free kill on the 3-1 on the there. Oh no, he's not? Okay, I see. Going for the face. Alright, so I would coin out Yeti here. Not terrible. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> Sounds like a play. Fortunately, the five two like I don't really I really don't want the ice rager to trade into the yeti, but if it keeps the seven three alive, maybe it's worth it. This kills this pretty easily. He's already at 18 health, so we kind of need to protect our face. Although the thin bog creeper looks like it's going to help a lot. I would just play three guys. We want the taunt totem, I think. Or the healing. Oh, healing good. Alright. This clears off this. Town would have been nice though. Kept the 7 2 alive. But if he doesn't clear here, it'll heal back up. Right, we got the the bog creeper here for the taunt. Pretty good. Do it like face. Here's some face damage. Savage roar. That's all you have. That's it. Okay. 
Uh. <clears throat> well, um, guess I'll kill that with the the weapon. Play it here, buddy. Set it for lethal next turn. Four, five, six, D seven. Could always hex that. Would hexing that be a good idea? If we hex that, we could do three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine to the face. Holding a dragon. Alright, play this. I want to play these two cards here. So maybe everything transcends here. Play this. He does three, four to our face. Looks like this sets up for lethal. Toasty. Elements guide me. Okay. That's the plan. Is it a swipe? Apparently. Okay, GG. Give a well played here. Well played. I can see. Ooh. All right, easy game. I must protect the one. For Doomhammer. Mm, really good Tuesday. Try for a th three. Eh, we do have a coin, so maybe this is worth keeping. Hard to say, I guess. We already have some excellent twos, so maybe we'll keep a four. Which one do we keep, the fire guard or the shredder? Probably the shredder. Put coin out whirling into whirling. It's pretty good. Mm, good curve. <laughs> so much damage. Death does not scare me. Although Death Lord is a pretty good counter, because Ah, uh, so we need five. Looks like this is gonna trade into here. You could play the the totem doesn't really do much unless we get the taunt, so we'll play this. Make him trade, because why would we trade? Death Lord counters Zapomatic. Stops it in its place. It's too bad. We have Shredder though. Shredder on four. Crack all that. 
But I kind of want to play Shredder here. And in turn 5, I guess we play the... Aceless? Maybe we play the Crackle, I'm not sure. <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. Whoops. Alright, so this has 1 HP, but it's gonna die next turn. This is frozen, so we can't really do much with that. I guess we'll play the... Faceless. If we play the Faceless we have... Next turn we'll have 5 mana. Put the Yeti here. Seems like a fine play. Why not faceless though? No reason, I guess. Play faceless. We get a guy from this uh this death death lord once it pops. And there are a lot of good guys we, we could get. I guess we're hoping for like strangle t uh, the tiger, maybe the ventrica. The silence is on, guy. What to do? Mm, buff. Okay, that's a good target for crackle. Take a walk on the wild side. Crackle proof. No Alright, so we could crackle that and then send the 7-7 seven, seven to you. That may be actually a decent play. Um, we do want to keep our board as much as we can. It seems like a little bit overkill, but... We'll crackle that. Pretty good one. And then for turn, we can also play a minion here. We can play a taunt. If we play a minion, it looks like it's going to die for free to the hero ability. He really wants to play hero ability next turn. So maybe we play the, the totem. If we get a taunt, that's pretty good for us. If we get a healing, that's not all, that's not bad. Okay. The spell damage though, not really that good. The healing would have been really good. Six mana, so we probably play the mechanical yeti and the zap. Join Looks like a three is gonna go to here. And we take seven, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Ouch, that's a lot of damage. Kill this, we'll take seven, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Hmm. We need a taunt totem then. What? Yeah, we really need a taunt totem. Okay, so we play this and taunt, I guess. Come on, taunt. It's not a taunt. Alright, well, so that's 
sometimes you just don't have the cards. We lose tempo. A death lord though. You asked for it. For Doomhammer. So who knew a uh, death lord is that OP in arena? Like literally, we couldn't do anything for like two turns because it killed our guy and then it just made a wall. By the time we got our minion, it was too late. Zombie child. Go ahead and pass here. I think we'll coin out a spider tank. We coin out spider tank and then turn three. Or we could just play the the whirling. I play this and then buff it. play this. It's gonna die for free, but it's okay. I mean, something to play. We'll play the spider on three. That way you can play a spider and have nothing on the board. trade into here so maybe we'll play the flame song. See what taunt we get. One taunt. Never a taunt. Can I light your fire? Okay. Put a fire guard here. Yeah. Nice. Got the four attack. It's pretty sweet. Looks like he's gonna clear off the flame tongue, so. Next turn we'll have five what mana. To do? What to do? Play the Yeti. Okay. Frozen there. The dancing swords isn't bad. Let's play Yeti. There's no reason to not play Yeti, I don't think. Or Shredder. Yeah, Shredder's really good. Shredder's even better. Okay, that's fair. Mm, punished. Punished. Bog Creeper. Let's see some way of getting through that. <laughs> An activator for his egg. There you go. So I wonder if this gets crackled. And then we can trade this and play it. Play taunt. If this misses though. If they get a healing, that would be really good. Yeah. No healing. I'll hit for 6 though, it's kind of hard to pass up on 6 damage. Okay. 
Okay, so fire alley is really good. And we'll play those the Zapomatic. Keep putting that damage down. Most of them are really high quality cards, so. Double kill with the zap, and then we can trade. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Maybe. It does load us up for a flame strike. Mm. Yeah, flame strike number two. Don't know. You play around it or no? I don't think so. He's already played one. If he flame strikes here, he gets this guy with the hero ability, and then we're left with the three one. That's pretty bad if he flame strikes. Maybe we'll just play hero ability. Another spell totem. All these spell damage totems. Can't seem to get a taunt. Okay, so he pops this guy. <laughs> well, hey, spell damage totem has a purpose now. To take damage for other stuff. <laughs> well played. Let's the hunt begin for Doomhammer. Mm. So, get rid of the crackle and the swords. Shoot for some earlier game. I was dissing on the spell ta the, the spell damage totem, and then all of a sudden, like it takes the <laughs> the bomb lover four damage. That was pretty funny. I guess we'll coin out the haunted creeper, and then we can play flame tongue. That would be the dream. He plays a three health guy. I wonder if we still play Flame Tongue. Yeah, I think we do. I'm playing Noyotron. Yeah. Huffer! No, not the Huffer! That's sad. Play Scarlet here. Yeti on four looks like. Yeah. So pop pop. I'm play Yeti. Now if he trades the stuff into the Yeti, then we play the Tiger. Oh, should have played that first. Whoops. Okay. Oh, now I play it. Change the plans. We play Maiden now. Get a free, uh, or squeeze in a hero buddy here. I am freed from the curse. That's pretty good. Okay. So this dies. And then we'll play this here. With Shaman, you have such a good. If you have good quality minions, it's pretty easy to do that. 
could the secret be? The light does not discriminate. Okay. Well, we can play another here, buddy. So I think we'll play the tiger. Alright, we could play the venture cutter. Tiger is better against the snipe. I don't think it'll be a snipe, but it could be. It's still better though. No snipe. Take this so this kills this here. Oh, freezing trap. Oh, I should have popped that first. Oh, whoops. That was a mistake. Whoops, my bad guys. Should have used the hero ability first to guarantee the the one. And then play that. That was my bad. Now Hunter is out of gas. We play this again. It's not even bad. We'll play Venture Cutter. I want to kill the, kill the Demolisher, but this is better. Oh, nice shot. Demolisher. Gets me anyway. Oof. Nice try. Okay, so... 7 mana 7 7 overload of 2. That's not very good, is it? This kills this here. And then it's surely to die to the demolisher. Or maybe my face. We play this and then we'll have 9 some 7 mana next turn. Okay. Oh! 7-1 lives. Looks like I have to trade now. Okay, we do have Hex. Can I call it? I can call it. Six. Okay, so this has to be Hex. So we have five, four mana to play around with. So it's either the Spider Tank, or it's the Warling plus the Totem. I think we'll play this. Oh, we could play this. This doesn't quite do three damage though. Hmm. This and this is three. But it gets taken out for free by the Demolisher. There's only a 1 in 3 chance of that happening. Play Spider Tank. He's still at 30 health. Wow. Mm. That's a big guy. If you get a Taunt Totem. We may be saved. Um, no taunts in our hands. Okay, we really need to taunt at him. So, four, four, and ten. For the king. Alright, come on, taunt. Cross your fingers, guys. One and four. Oh, air toad him again. Now, technically, we don't necessarily lose. But, um, it seems very likely because he has hero ability, so we lose next turn. And we have no healing, so yeah, we're in a rough spot. I think it's over, guys. The 10 is too strong. Ah!
Taunt, see, look at the difference a Taunt Totem would have made. That would have been 10 health. We could have saved by playing Taunt. That's amazing. Or if this, or if we had a dragon. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. I am freed from the curse. So I can't say we made too many mistakes that game, except for the totem. That was huge. Missing the on the maiden there. 